you need anyone. Hello everybody. The amount of times I've been trying to film this video is insane. Every time I filmed it, either the quality was so bad that I couldn't possibly upload it, then the second time I didn't write anything down and I didn't know what to say because everything in my head is messy. As you've seen by the title, today I'm gonna be talking about the after casting, who is announced yet, then the rumors, who will play a certain character. I'm gonna be talking about that. I have slept maybe five hours. I went to s I couldn't sleep because as psychic as it sounds, the process of the after movie is consuming my life. That is not certainly good. Think of all the actresses and actresses that, that have been announced yet, the producers that have, that have been announced. Just makes my stomach turn and twist. I wrote down things this time because every time I wanted to film this video, I didn't write anything down and my hat is a mess since all of the informations are floating in. And I also got my dad's phone because I'm filming with my phone so I can go on to Instagram and see also stuff that I could talk about. Today I'm going to be talking about the actresses and actors that have been announced for the movie yet, um, for which roles, what I think about them. So yeah, let's get started. First, be talking about the day that Harden and Tessa have been announced, like the actress, uh, the actress and the actor. So as you might all know, Harden is going to be played by Hero Finnis. I'll put a picture right here. Harden is going to be played by Hero Finnis. He is 20 years old, which I think is extremely good because Harden is 20, so it makes everything much more realistic. He played someone in Harry Potter. I've never been a big fan of Harry Potter, so I don't know. Yeah. He's 20 years old. He's from England. Yeah, the day he, he was announced, I think that was in May. I didn't picture Harden as Hero because well, to be honest, I've always imagined Harden and S. Harry Styles. I mean, who didn't? With his long hair, I can insert a picture right here because it's so much fun to put in the pictures into videos. I have imagined a Harden like this. And um, so I've kind of had to be more open to different kind of actors. I've actually preferred Nicholas Galitzine, I think his name is, he's 23. But after a time, I kind of got very used to him, if that makes sense. And I accepted him as, as Harden. The thing I like about Hero is that he's 20 and that it makes everything so realistic because guys his age too, stuff like that, that happen in after. But I think he can put, portray the role so much better because every time there's like a movie about, let's say, a 19 year old, she's played by a 29 year old actress. And that's not realistic, so you can't really compare yourself to them because that's not possible. You can't com com compare your 19 year old self to a 19 29 year old. As I've said, I wasn't really fond of him at first, but after a time and after I've seen so many edits of him and I've talked to my friends about it, I've kind of got to terms with him. I think he's going to portray the role very, um, very good and I'm very excited to see him. I'm just a little update. So as of now, I got really fond of Hero and I really, really like him as the role. I feel like I've talked very negatively about him and that was never my intention. Just wanted to clarify that. It, it's just so unrealistic, but we'll come to that. On the same day, Tessa was announced. Her name is Julia Goldani Tellis. She's from Brazil and she's 23. She has a very, very lovely face. I think she's very, very sweet. But, you know, I... I was a bit salty, to be honest. I know everyone says that, but Tessa is described as not really that she has self-esteem issues, but also she has them and she's got more hips and she's got more stomach. Julia is a very, very beautiful girl, but she doesn't really have the body type that I've imagined Tessa to have. I know everyone, I think everyone has pictured her as Indiana Evans. I didn't, I don't know why, I just couldn't. Um, but I've imagined her with a bit more, like a more chubby face. Yeah, I was so sad. To be honest, I had to step away off all of the fan pages of after because I got so sad. I was probably a bit dramatic, but that's just how I felt back then. And also I thought that Hero and Julia, she looks older and he looks younger. I didn't have anything against the actress. I have questioned 
Anna Todd's decision. I know she said that they had great chemistry, but I don't know, maybe because Tessa is so close to my heart that I was maybe a bit um, overreacting, but I know a lot of people liked her. I know a lot of people didn't like her. But then I randomly went on Twitter to find out that Julia will no longer play Tessa. And I was like, girl, they're gonna start filming in one week. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> Um, but she had to cancel the role because of scheduling issues. The role of Tessa was recasted and the new Tessa was already in Atlanta with Hero Finnis to rehearse together. So I was like, girl, that came too fast. I'm overwhelmed. What is going on? And so it must have been in the talks for longer because how do you find an actress in such a short period of time that will practice all of the lines and just become the main leading role and then fly to Atlanta to already practice with her future co-star so the rumor went around that Josephine Langford I'll put a picture of her right here will play the role Josephine Langford is 20 years old as I've researched she's the sister of Catherine Langford Hannah Baker from 13 reasons why and she does look like Tessa she really does look like Tessa the thing is she doesn't really have a lot of pictures of herself on her Instagram and there are a lot of movies she's been in um, so it was hard for us to find out more about her because there's not very a lot I don't know what her body type is I'm praying I'm very much praying that she has more hips yeah so she was rumored and then two days later the new Tessa was announced and it's Josephine Langford I do really like her I think she's got the hair there's nothing much more I can say about her because there aren't really very much a lot of pictures of herself and her body and all that stuff. And I think Hero and Josephine look so much better, look so much better together than Julia and Hero. And the fact that they're both the same age will make everything just so much more realistic. And every everyone seemed to to love her. I've seen so many comments about how perfect she is for the role. Then, at the same day, Jace was being announced. Jace, a character that does matter, but is not necessarily a leading role like Landon or Zed or Molly or stuff that make a bit a, a much more impact on the story. Of course, Jace has an impact on the whole story and does make a difference because if you forgot who Jace was, Jace was the one who Hardin was afraid of, the one who smoke sweet all the time and the one who didn't go to college he said he didn't do the college thing and he pushed Harden to tell Tessa about the bat. He was described as not a very nice guy but yeah um, his name is Swen Tamil I think. He is from Austria which is cool because he, he then speaks German and I'm German so that's pretty cool. I didn't picture Jace as this guy who is 26 year old which is insane to think about because I thought he was 35 or something. I'm excited how he will play the role but yeah I don't have anything else to say about him. Then two teachers were being announced well actually only one and unofficially. So this woman said she was going to be oh my goodness yeah no nah. and she said she was going to be play an astronomical teacher and that got me so excited because everything just comes to life and it's so unrealistic to think about for me. No one has been officially announced except for Tessa, Harden and Jace but there has been this rumor that this guy right here, his name is, I don't freaking know, his name is John Luis Castellanos and he's rumored to play Zad and if this guy right here is going to be playing Zad then holy shit as a cap caption for his picture he said Atlanta um Georgia I'm coming for you hashtag let's go and the after movie is set in Atlanta and someone commented under the picture said as F and he liked the picture so that could mean that he will play Zad didn't picture Zed, like him. I, who did I imagine as Zed? Probably Zane, <laughs> but not all the time. Most of the times with the books I've made up my own character. I didn't really picture anyone except for Harry. But if he's going to play BB playing Zed, then Jesus Christ. I don't know anything about him. I don't know how, ho how old is, uh, he is. There's no information about him on the internet. He is a model and he has a girlfriend. That 
these two things is what I'm aware of. That's everything for the casting. Now I'm just going to be talking about why I've been thinking posting so many pictures of like the whole process of the movie and every day they're posting a picture of the producer or the filming crew and then a, 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 a new casting member gets announced and it's all too much for my brain because I've never actually believed that there was gonna be a movie never and as much as I hated to say that I don't know if I want it to become a movie because I feel like they're my children and I don't want to give them away to the, to the world and that everyone will be aware of the books there's probably going to be judgmental people that judge the books and judge the acting skills and I'm just so scared that my imaginations are gonna get destroyed. I'm just scared that the rooms that I've pictured forget as soon as the movie comes out. This book has been with me since 2015. I know I've started reading it very late. I know so many people have read it on Wattpad. I didn't actually. I've never been on Wattpad very often. I can't really explain how I'm feeling. I still don't want to realize it that, that these characters are gonna be on the screen. It's so insane to think about. I think no one has ever thought that after the story of, of Wattpad, the fan fiction was going to, to be on the screen. I'll stop talking now. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.